Blessings and peace to you. This is SB Favor Thinking Podcast, and my name is SB Favor. How are you doing today? It is Thursday, April 21st, 2022. Another wonderful day, and another day to be thankful. And as I always say, if you focus on what is good, then you can project something good to happen. So make sure. You focus on what is good. Don't sit around focusing on all the negative things and all the things that don't benefit you. Focus on the things that make you feel good. But most importantly, make sure you focus on what is good. I hope everyone is having a good Thursday. The sun is shining on the East Coast. Well, in some places it is. So I hope everybody is having a good day. And I hope that If you are out there traveling about, I hope that you are keeping yourself safe and keep your family members safe. Because guess what? We are still in the middle of a pandemic. And I know the mask mandate has been lifted in some places. But guess what? If you want to really be wise about it, wear your mask when you need to. I always remind you of that because I care. And so make sure you keep yourself safe and keep your family members safe because people are still becoming ill. So please do your part to stay safe. If you would like to give to the podcast, you can give at cash app dollar sign sb favor thank you so much for your support and your donations i always remind you of that because there are some generous people out there that's supporting this podcast and i appreciate you all so much once again if you'd like to give to the podcast you can give at cash app dollar sign sb favor thank you so much well the topic of this episode is my inspirational quote. No major topic today, y'all. I'm coming soon with a, a topic. But for now, I'm going to give you an inspirational quote. My inspirational quote for today is, We must practice believing more and doubting less. Think about this for a second. What if every time you believed something could happen it just happened in front of you quickly what if what if if you just believe something in one hour and then it happened in the next hour well guess what that can happen i believe that we should practice believing more and doubting less unfortunately sometimes due to Uh, Something that may have happened in our past or sometimes if something doesn't happen quick enough. Then unfortunately doubt can sometimes enter in. So I just want to remind you make sure that you practice believing more every single day. Just practice believing more and doubting less. And when I say practice believing more I'm talking about just putting your faith in your confidence and just being convinced that what you want to see happen is going to happen. Just practice believing more and doubting less. Last week I was talking about faith. And faith and believing is pretty much the same thing. But when you believe something, it's a matter of just being absolutely, totally convinced Even when you don't see something happening quickly, just practice believing. When nothing happens according to what you are expecting, you still should practice believing. Every single day, we must practice believing. Believing in The things we want to see happen according to how we speak, according to how we think, according to our conversations. All of those things should be a reflection of practicing believing, believing in what you want to see, giving energy to the thing you want to happen. I wanted to talk about this real quick because... Sometimes right in the midst of the of 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 a, a moment's time you get to choose whether you're going to believe or whether you're not going to believe in that moment. So I just want to remind you to 
practice believing. Just believe. It could be something that you have thought about years ago and because it didn't happen quick enough, you stopped believing for that certain thing to happen. Well, guess what? Just start again. Believing, practicing, believing that the thing you want it to happen, it can still happen. Just start again, believing and practice believing, practice believing every single day. Practice believing in what you want to happen, not just for you, but for your family, for your children. When you think about that topic of that situation, just practice believing. Believe it in your mind like it's already happening. Believe it in your mind according to how you see it. How you believe it can happen. You know, it's so easy to get stuck on what's not happening. It's easy to do that. It's easy to wake up in the morning and just get stuck on, well, certain things didn't happen yet. It's easy to get stuck. So I use the word practice because when you practice something over time, it becomes easier and easier as you practice. So that is why I use the word practice to practice believing. Practice believing just by meditating on what you want to see happen. Practice. Practice believing by, by doing confession, speaking it out loud. Giving thanks to God. Lord, thank you that that goal that I prayed about last year is happening now. Yes, that's that's practicing. Because if you take each day to practice believing, you will feel better. You will believe stronger. And the very thing that you want to see happen, it's going to happen. So practice believing. Practice believing that what you want to happen, it can happen. Don't think about how big it is. Don't think about how something could be uncertain. Don't think about how... You're going to get the money to do it. Don't think about those things. Take action in the direction. Yes, take action. Apply yourself to something. Yes. And leave the how to God. But most importantly, just practice believing. As you take action, practice believing. Believing, like I said a minute ago, practice believing according to how you think, how you speak, The actions you take, your conversations. Don't let nobody persuade you to go back another direction. Because when you're practicing something, you become better and better. You become stronger and stronger. So practice believing. That's it. What I'm saying to you today I hope that you run with it. I pray that you get manifestations from it. And I pray that you don't give up, but that you just consistently, constantly practice believing. Practice believing that that business that you visioned in your mind can happen. Practice believing. Practice believing that the things you want for your children, it can happen. If you practice believing, I'm trying to convince you of this because guess what? This thing I'm talking about, this is what I use for myself. I've done it many, many times where I told myself, no, I'm not going to go back in the other, the other direction because in the other direction is worry, doubt, fear, unbelief. You don't want that. 
So just practice believing. You can't go wrong when you center yourself in the midst of believing. Now, I could use the word faith. I could say, you know, have faith, have faith. I could say all that, right? But no, I want to say it like this. Practice believing. Believing in what you want to see so that you can manifest what you believe. Practice believing. It's simple as that. All day, every day, practice believing. I I have to tell myself this because there are things that I have prayed for in my life personally. I know and I am convinced that it is, I'm speaking present tense, it is happening because I am practicing believing. So I'm saying this to you. Every single day, practice believing and doubting less. So, on that note, that's all I have to say. (laughs) I hope that you are encouraged. I hope that you are inspired. I hope that you have a good rest of the week. I hope that you stay focused on what is good. And remember that you have the power within you to manifest anything you want to do or anything you want to be. If you practice believing, just simply believe and leave the hell to God. So thank you so much for listening to SB Favor Thinking Podcast. If you need to reach me, you can reach me at sbfavor at yahoo.com via email. You can also find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at SB Favor. I also have a TikTok handle at SP Favor there. There is inspirational and motivational content there. You can also find me on YouTube and anywhere podcasts on are heard. Apple Podcasts, Amazon Audible. Subscribe wherever you listen to podcasts and make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. Make sure you click like, leave me some feedback and make sure, more, most importantly, Make sure you share the podcast with others. You can do no wrong with that. You can only do good. So make sure you share the podcast with others. And thank you so much for your support. And thank you for tuning in once again to SB Favorite Thinking Podcast. Thank you so much. And you have a good day.